Hello, fearless netizens! Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I will going to show to you how I make my rope and bowl display board. Let's get into it. Let us prepare first the materials. What is rope and bowl display board? This board consists of two parallel horizontal poles tied loosely together with the rope. Visual aids such as posters can be pinned to the rope. This kind of display board is invaluable where there are few solid walls for displaying information. It has no solid backings and can be made quickly for teaching, training, and when working with communities. Why it is important to have a display board in the classroom? Display boards in the classroom are a terrific method to get your students involved, excited, and working together which will help them learn more and improve their own abilities. Additionally, for children who are visual learners, display boards are an excellent learning tool because they allow them to see exactly what is being said to them. Finally, one of the most significant advantages of classroom display boards is that it encourages students to take greater pleasure in their work by displaying it for all to see. Classroom display boards, in general, may be a greater addition to any classroom. They not only promote visual learning and interactive courses, but they also aid the development of personal skills and impression of creativity in youngsters. After preparing all the materials, we can now tie the poles with the rope. Finally, we can now pin or clip the posters of our chosen topic in the rope and pole display board. I have chosen the topic integer rules. For in mathematics, integers play a crucial role. In practically every discipline, integers aid in the calculation of efficiency in positive and negative numbers. The position of one's feet is determined by integers. Students must understand the concept of integers before they can learn how to solve simple problems operations with the integers. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you've learned something. 